Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley Lanise. I make videos on spirituality and motivation, blending the two energies together so that you can get the best benefit out of it. Today's video is going to be how to intention set with candles. Let's get started. So my first tip for intention setting with candles is to connect with source. Whenever you are doing any spiritual work, be it crystal grids, be it candles, be it tarot cards, anything like that, it is always important to connect back to what you think source is. You're watching this video because you're a spiritual person, so it's safe to believe that you must have some kind of connection with source or with the universe people have different ideas of what source is. For me, source is God, and God is the energetic vibration of unconditional love and only unconditional love. Irregardless of what you believe source is, connect with your version of source before you intention set with candles. When you start your candle intention setting, say, I am connecting with state what your version of source is, and only this version of source. That way, if you believe in any other spiritual energies, you are opening your candle intention setting up for just what you believe source is, and then you are safe and very protected going down your spiritual journey. The second thing you do, and the fun part, is you get a candle. I prefer to use really long, thin candles because they're just so much fun. I mean, look at this candle. Like, you can get them online anywhere, and it's just fun. They have different colors. Colors can be associated with things. I can make a video on that if you guys would like me to go deeper, but for this really quick and short video, you get your candle, and this is a bonus tip. Not everybody does this step, but what you can do is you can take a toothpick and you can carve something into the candle, like the word love, self-love, gratitude, manifesting my reality. You can write all over this thing. However much stuff you want to fit on this candle, you can do. Now, if you have like a tea light candle and you can't write in the candle, you can just open up your journal and write that you're doing a candle intention setting ritual. And then you can write down what you want, connect with your version of source, and then close your connection with your source. That way you are all spiritually protected. Then what you do is when you light the candle, you think about what you are trying to manifest. So if I was trying to manifest self-love or set the intention of self-love coming into my life, then with your third eye, channel that connection with source energy. You want to really think about self-love and vibrate on that level. Then you light the candle and as the candle is being lit, you make a constant effort to think about self-love. You can even do things that are self-loving. You can relax for a while. You can play a video game if that's what you do to love yourself and unwind. You can blow the candle out and then light it again later. It's really up to you how you do your practice. Then once you are done, you close the connection with source energy. You say, you think, or you write, I am closing this candle intention set setting with, and then you insert who you think source is. So I would say God of love and only love. And this is the only energy that I allow into my candle intention setting ritual. So that is all that I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching this video all the way until the end. If you have any comments, write them down below because I just love hearing from you guys. And if you like videos like this, hit the subscribe, hit the like, and I will see you all in the next video.